Hey everyone, in today's video, we take a look at the 22 liter jetpack from Archetype, designed and built right here in the USA with high quality materials also sourced from the USA. The jetpack maintains the signature low profile we've come to love from Archetype without sacrificing on quality or durability. If you're new to the channel, I'm Theo with Rush Faster, and we do guides and walkthroughs on gear just like this. So if you're interested in that, please consider subscribing. Let's get into the 22 liter jetpack from Archetype. Based right here out of San Francisco, California, Archetype is a small team passionate about creating high quality gear for a wide range of users. Now, Archetype has gained recognition from Carryology for the likes of their 15 liter dash pack, which won the Reader's Choice Award for Best Everyday Backpack, as well as their RMK, their compact metal keychain. Taking a look at the new 22 liter jetpack, you can see that there is a slight difference with the 15 liter dash pack, but they share a lot of the same materials, build quality with a few key differences I'll point out along the way. Now, just like its predecessor, the dash pack, the jetpack does not compromise when it comes to material selection. The exterior materials are made of a 1680 denier ballistic nylon with DWR coating, and the interior is made of a 210 denier double walled ripstop nylon. With the release of the Jetpack, Archetype is also releasing their special edition wax canvas version. Now this is a waterproof bag as well, made of a 10 ounce army duck wax canvas. And this is a beautiful bag that continues to take on its own personality as you continue to use it. The interior is the same high quality shared 210 denier double walled ripstop nylon. The wax canvas version does come in slightly heavier at two pounds, six ounces, compared to its ballistic nylon counter type, which comes in at two pounds, two ounces. Taking a look at the front of the bag, we can see that the jet pack maintains a very similar profile to the dash pack. And that is that low profile that we've come to like from Archetype. At the base of the bag, we do have a front ladder stitch webbing. This is made of a 4,000 pound critical use class one mil spec webbing. So really fantastic and sturdy material. Great if you wanna attach some more gear on there or perhaps a bike light if you happen to be riding at night really great way to attach some more gear on there flipping over to the back of the bag we can look at the harness system starting at the top of the shoulder straps we have a four panel seat belt webbing and the foam material on the shoulder pads as well as the back panel of the bag is an evazote high density closed cell ev50 foam this is really for maximal support as well as breathability for the user the shoulder straps are cut mostly straight with a slight contour at the base of the strap. And we do notice that there is with the jetpack a removable sternum strap. This does come off with a clasp on either side of the sternum strap there. And there are two points at which you can attach the sternum strap for your comfort or for being able to distribute the load while you're wearing the bag. On the sternum strap itself, we see some Duraflex hardware with the buckle and a little bit of elastic strap management. Fantastic way to control the tail end of the sternum strap. At the base of both straps, we have Duraflex ladder locks, as well as that same four panel seat belt webbing. Really easy way to adjust the shoulder straps there. And the shoulder straps attach on either side with these wings, does help with the contour of the shoulder straps on your body. And on the left side portion of the bag, we do see a small archetype tag, as well as a made in the USA tag. Taking a look at the back panel, we can see that there is a discrete pocket here. Now this pocket does run the entire height of the whole back panel. This is a number eight YKK zipper with a water repellent zip. And this is a 550 pound paracord zipper pull. Really fantastic there. Looking inside this discrete pocket, we can see that 210 denier double walled ripstop nylon, really great material, as well as a single zippered organization pocket. In there, I have my sixth generation iPad. Now in this pocket, Archetype tells us that you can fit up to a 10 inch tablet, as well as within this discrete pocket, you can fit up to a 14 inch laptop or a slim 15 inch laptop. You can also store any documents or perhaps if you're traveling, you can place your passport in here. Really great, nice discreet pocket that is out of sight when you're wearing the bag. 
One other thing to note about the back panel is that Archetype has included an ABS frame sheet for added support and structure. Let's say you don't want that in the bag. You can remove it with this simple Velcro strap here. And we can access that ABS frame sheet and take it out if you're no longer interested in using that. Really custom way to wear the bag as well as remove the structure when not necessary. Okay, moving on to the side of the bag. We can see on the right side body portion of the bag, there are two D rings, one at the top of the bag, as well as the base where it attaches to the wing. Another great way to add some more gear onto the bag. Looking at the side pocket, is it is a stretchable water bottle pocket and it is gusseted. So when you're not using it, it does lay quite flat, but it does expand. And Archetype tells us we can fit up to a 32 ounce water bottle. So I have my 32 ounce Hydro Flask water bottle slips in very easily and can compress down and lock with this hardware here. Now this compression strap is a 2,500 pound critical use class one mil spec webbing, as well as the same with the top grab handle here. So these are really sturdy materials as well. Moving on to the front of the bag, we can see on the side profile, we can access the discrete front access pocket that unzips here. And that is that number eight YKK water repellent zipper. Looking inside, we do have some webbing here. It is a bit hard to see, but it is a webbing that is stitched and allows for cable organization. So in there, I have my USB cable as well as a secondary USB cable and my Leatherman wave tool, which fits inside that stretch webbing very nicely. At the very top of that webbing, we do have another D-ring and attached there, I have my RMK compact metal keychain. And this is Archetype's award-winning metal keychain. Fantastic use there and attaches very well on that D-ring. On there, I have my Bellroy key case. Looking inside the bag, it is that same 210 denier double wall grip stop nylon and a single zippered compartment. In that zippered compartment, I have my black ember magfold wallet, as well as two pens in pen holder. Really great front pocket, very easily accessible when the bag is out in front of you, say on a desk or a table, very easy to reach in and grab what you're using. Moving on to the main compartment, we've got two YKK zips with that water repellent zip and those two 550 pound paracord zipper pulls. One thing to note if you're into details is that the main compartment zippers do butt up against these compression straps. So they do pass all the way underneath it. If you happen to be a little bit nitpicky, something to note. This is very similar to the dash pack that we've seen prior. Okay, looking inside the bag, at the very top, we have a mesh zippered compartment. Inside there, I have my AirPods, my sunglasses, as well as my nimble rechargeable battery. We also have a second zippered compartment. This one is a little bit more shallow. In there, I have my flossers, as well as some hand sanitizer. Getting into the main compartment, it's quite spacious. In there, I have my Sony over-the-ear headphones, as well as my cable bag. And inside the base there, I have my Eddie Bauer packable jacket. Looking at the device portion of the bag, this is a padded portion of the bag, as well as compression here to keep your devices secure. Archetype tells us we can fit up to a 15 inch laptop computer. In there, I have my 13 inch MacBook Pro. And last but not least, at the very top of the bag, we have that D-ring that you can attach further gear to. Overall, a really fantastic bag, really great double walled ripstop lining inside, really quality selected materials and nothing less that we would expect from our type. Okay, let's go ahead and do our rush faster beer capacity test. So I've had to open up the compression straps all the way, and it is a little bit of a snug fit, but the Jetpack will fit 24 12 ounce cans. Fantastic capacity there. So here is the Jetpack on body for your reference. I'm 5'7". This is the ballistic nylon version. Here's the special edition waxed canvas version.
This has been a review of the 22 liter Archetype Jet Pack, a modern low profile day pack made of quality USA source materials. The Jet Pack is a highly designed and exceptionally constructed day pack that reflects the quality we've come to associate with Archetype. If you're interested in purchasing the Jet Pack in either the Ballistic Nylon version or the Special Edition Wax Canvas version, or if you're interested in purchasing any of the materials you've seen in the video today, feel free to use the affiliate links in the description below, and those really do go a long way to helping out our channel. If you think we've earned it, give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel so you won't miss out on our latest gear reviews. We constantly have opportunities for you to win gear of your own, so be sure to subscribe to our monthly newsletter so you won't miss out. But for now, this has been a review of the 22 liter Archetype Jetpack. Take care, and we'll see you next time.